could you feel that fourth quarter come in play? Did you did you sense something like that was in you? Uh, I know it's always in me, but I mean, these things just happen naturally. I can't. If I could plan to do that every fourth quarter, I would, but it's just not the game of ball. It's just a flowy game that great things happen when with time. Clay, you you talked about wanting to be that player you was before you left. Mm-hmm. Well, what does it mean to you to be? Able, I know you know you can do it, but you yeah. just did it. What does it mean to you to to come this far? It's uh, really inspiring for myself. Um, there are so many long days in this building. So many long days doing the most tedious of things, and some I wasn't used to prior because of my ability to play nightly. So now to be able to do that. I mean, I'm just gonna inspires me to keep going. I mean, I'm not satisfied and I'm not gonna lie, I felt really freaking good though. Clay, you look a, a lot looser on the court. And I think during that fourth quarter, you let out a shimmy. Like, where did that come from? What, what was that? Um, I've seen Steph do it for so many years. I mean, try to shake the misses out or something. I don't know. It felt great though. Wow. Felt great. Do you feel looser now post-injury, though? Is that something you feel? Because it does seem like you are, you know. I mean, I feel looser than I did the first five games. That was a very big adjustment period for me. And now to be back uh, shooting with no hesitation and cutting and playing real basketball, I mean, it feels great. And I'm just going to play loose, hopefully, from here on out. Now that you're at. 30 minutes nightly, um, how much more free does that make you feel out there where you know you're going to get basically kind of like a full rotation? It's easier to get into a better rhythm. Um, And I'm in better shape than I was a few weeks ago. Then on top of that, it's just uh, I'm just grateful to play that many minutes. That's some real, real good minutes right there. Just hitting 30 points for the first time since you come back. Does that mean anything? Oh, yeah. What? After not feeling that feeling for a few years? Yeah. It's, do not take a 30 ball lightly in this league. Does it mean something special to do it before this crowd against that team? Uh, that meant something special to do it in front of my dad. I don't think he's seen me play in a few years. So I know he's proud of me, and, and uh, that's always fun. Look yeah, like- our crowd, too. Our crowd was great out there. Clay looked like you got revved up when you made the lefty layup, got the and one after not maybe getting one uh, a couple of minutes before that. Was that particularly a, a satisfying play for you? Oh, yeah, especially after you get your, your shot pinning against the backboard. It feels good to, you know, let the defense know that that's not going to deter me, and that felt great. You had a couple of nice hookups of beating Kaminga uh, early. What's the connection there, and what are you guys seeing from this 19-year-old uh, right now? I can't take credit for those hookups because I had zero assists. But other than that, John is – I mean, isn't that crazy he's not going to be in the Rising Stars game? He just guarded LeBron James for however many minutes, gave us 18 on 11 shots and almost a double-double. Like, how many more 19-year-olds, 20-year-olds are doing that? I, 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 don't, I don't know. Or just basically, for maybe for the first time, intimated that he's in the playoff rotation. Have you guys seen that? Like, this this guy has earned his way into the rotation. Oh, yeah. When you do what he did tonight, I mean, gosh, he's a, just a very strong young man with incredible athleticism, and his skills are more polished than people want to give him credit for. Wait, can you describe what that feeling is like when you get in that zone? And, and as a sort of related part of that, when the crowd gets into it, I mean, it's a different kind of energy. It seems like it's a, uh, it's the best feeling you could possibly have besides winning the whole thing as a player. Cause you just are so confident in those moments and, you know, you don't think about the work you put in, but post game you do. And those moments is what really makes it all worth it. Clay, tonight, LeBron passed Kareem to become the all-time leading scorer for regular season and playoffs wow. combined. I mean, what, is, what does that mean? That's, uh, that's unbelievable. I mean, Kareem, 
kind of feel for him because he had to play four years of collegiate ball, but that doesn't take anything away from what LeBron did. That's uh, that type of consistency and dedication to the game. That's, uh, you know, only the greats have that in them, and he's obviously one of them, one of the best to ever do it. So I don't know how much longer he has. Maybe it's two years, three, but NBA fans should, uh, should just appreciate him while we're watching such an amazing athlete. Clay, there was a moment there where you came out just for a short stint, but you probably knew it was short, I imagine, when you set out. But was that is that less difficult knowing? I had no idea, but it made it a little easier. You know, you don't get as cold. And I'm just still getting uh, used to I mean, this what a great night. I had a lot of fun and build off it and hopefully do it again on Monday. Play with with Jonathan. Do you see something uh, over here? Do you see something special in the way that he rises to the occasion with, in a game like this? Oh yeah, yeah. I wasn't doing that at twenty or nineteen. I was in Pullman, so I mean, Warrior fans should be very excited for our future. Like to have the vets we deal with the young talent. It's it's rare in sports. So uh john just got to keep him humble and keep working because he does things you, that cannot be taught what do you just generally think you guys are playing right now i think we're playing well i think we can always get better well if, and i hope if we we would be really nice to win the next two before all-star break nice good stuff I